Hello and welcome to another First Impressions video brought to you by MMO Play. Today we're taking a look at a free-to-play browser-based game called King Kingcraft Rush. This is somewhere between a CCG and a Pick 3 style game. I'm going to go through the tutorial briefly, but I'm going to skip forward and actually do a couple of hands myself. So you start with a hand of five cards and you're trying to make poker hands basically. And other than that, just kind of... Different combinations yield different types of attacks, also increases your pool for different schools of magic which can trigger special abilities. The tutorial will guide you through it and teach you the basics, but I want to get into a game where I'm playing by myself, not having the game play for me. And we're going to go through to the campaign real quick, do the first mission. This is the very first one. So if you're a fan of, I would say probably more like poker and pick three style games for usually uh, tablets. The first thing you notice is we start with a 3x3 three three grid, you have a 5x5, five five, and then you just kind of fill it in. So I can play two cards, so I can play a fire here, and then over to the left, I got three in a row, and it's fire, it'll increase my fire pool. And if my fire gets up high enough, I'll be able to cast a special ability. Also, based on what kind of cards you play, or what kind of poker hand you get, you do damage. You can see the life bar kind of above the, it's a yellow bar above my uh, portrait and above their portrait. Alright, I can play here two of these. Now, I could have played it in column number two and it would have given me a full house. That probably would have been better, but this was enough to win. This was against a, an AI opponent, so obviously first mission is going to be easy. There is a progression system. You'll gain levels, which will let you unlock gear and heroes and all that is ways to customize your character. So I'm going to go and unlock this hero right here. Well, the tutorial is kind of telling me I have no choice. And it does a little cutscene here to see if you can control the hero. So much like Pokemon, I have to defeat him first. He's now mine. And he's in my pool of heroes. It'll affect the abilities of all your different elements. So you can specialize if you really want to. You can only have five heroes at a time active, so I gotta dismiss one to get room for him. And then other than that, we also have a progression system to work with. Alright, I just won that one. Which means I got some more XP, I've gained a level. Now I have a new item and some other rewards. And I can go take that. I will say, just so you know, on my slightly outdated system right here, this game does run a bit choppy. So maybe it might be a little harder on some systems than others. All right, I got my new dagger. You can also go and upgrade it, but that does take some special items, which we're going to look at right now. So I got my dagger here. I'll say I want to enhance it. It's a multi-step process, so the tutorial will guide me through it. Go through this. And then I have to go down the tab. Which gives me an essence to be able to upgrade it. Click there, and then go down to the final tab. And then I click this, which increases the item. And it has a new essence. Modifies it. This weapon will allow me to be a little more effective with certain schools of magic. So, nice little way to specialize your character. A little bit, a little bit more depth than just a traditional pick three. So, it's not completely poker meets bejeweled. Poker meets bejeweled with an RPG element. And my opponent is going to go ahead and hit me with a pair. Not all that painful. I believe I'm going to hit him with four of a kind, though, or full house. I have both viable options. I might hold the four of a kind for a minute. So there's a full house. Smash. Did about a third of his life there. And it gave me quite a bit of fire mana, too. And I'm thinking this is a good opportunity for four of a kind. Play my two blues in column three, probably. Yeah, there we go. After that, I guess five of the kind is probably the best you get because there's no going to be uh, royal flush in this one. There's no suits. You can play by the diagonal too, so keep that in mind. You also can get multi hits if you can create like a Z or a cross. It will trigger. I'm trying to figure out what I want. I actually really want to get the four of a kind in the bottom, but it's not letting me. And there is a timer. You can the right, the timer is ticking down. I'm running out of time. I better get something down. Hmm, what am I going to play if it's not letting me play that four of a kind? I'm going to play over here and get a three of a kind? 
I also go to gone for two pairs. Oh, and I killed him. Game, check it out. It's available for free called King Kingcraft Rush. The content. Stay tuned for more for MMO play. Oh, more items. 